Nishoniko Hinnishnado Aakwichi Shishtelido Good morning, my friend. Yat Eben. You are listening to Dine Adventist Radio, your voice of hope, happiness, health, Ado Hojon for Dine Bekeya and beyond. Dale Wolcott, Yinishye. I am your host, and today we again welcome Gregory Holliday with wonderfully encouraging words for you, especially if you have been feeling down or discouraged because of how your life has been going. Last week, Gregory shared his story of God changing his life. God's Word promises you that He can do for you exactly what He has done for Gregory and for thousands upon thousands of others. Your Creator gives you this promise. I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you a future and a hope. Jeremiah 29, 11. <laughs> Just before we hear Gregory's message, I want to remind you that in about 20 minutes, we will have this week's edition of Kids Time with Kristen and Martessa. Now here is Gregory. My topic today would be about God is love. Let us bow our head today and put our lives in the Savior's hand. We ask that you will take our words into your hands, Lord. Lord, we know that without you, we cannot succeed. So come near to us and uplift each one of us. These things we ask you in your mighty name. Amen. We would like to talk to you and thank everyone for joining us again this morning. My name is Gregory Holiday from Ocheto, Utah. I'm a Salt Clan and my father is a Hudichitni. In our first session, we're brief about our life before we met Jesus. And then our second session was how we were converted. And then the third one would be about my life after I met Jesus. Before we go into our briefing, I would like to just quickly talk about myself before I met Jesus. First of all, nobody is born a Christian. I was raised by my grandparents, which meant that I was raised in a very traditional way. But I was raised with love, with respect for other people. Every day we had to do something, like herding sheep, taking horses to the water, but nothing was said about Christianity or even about Jesus. I started my school in Navajo Mountain Boarding School. By the time I was in high school, I started drinking alcohol. After I finished high school, I went back home. We live in a mining area called Moonlight. Everybody drank. Everybody seemed to be drinking. Nobody told me it was bad. Drinking was just normal. And then I went to college. I drank with friends and still nothing was said about Jesus. Finally, one day a nurse came by with a book. It was called Steps to Christ. And I got so interested in this little book. I read it again and again. But I never realized that Jesus will overcome your addiction. I started using alcohol very heavily. I would come home. I would search for alcohol to see if there's anything left from the night before. I've been involved in many automobile accidents, sometimes very close to death. Then I divorced my first wife, all because of alcohol. I thought about committing suicide many times. I ate out of trash cans, slept in trash bags. I slept in culverts so small enough to squeeze through. I must have been thrown in in every jail across the reservation. Yet, with all my mistake and shortcoming, I started going to church. Gregory Holiday 
Ertelab an yad elki zene eya she ina eh el kitab eh nishnane chizus ato beho sihenta Ado enta chizus beho sasindi ke yiki nana Nabik ishe eya she ina sakit ego oyilagi i ben kikasnen lindo lirkadoko Ado enta sen zengi ban yashti ke ya chizus ato beho sintande Ako te nezra asko konit eri Do e chiesa spero di non tanti di chico. Ado che si è quasi, quasi sopra in chi è a hoco, ado da inicla. Se è a te, se c'è do, se c'è e a se ne sacco. Ado è go e a te ne venne a raggio, ado conti e a te ne venne a raggio. O che te ne, a io ne e, be e a te ne venne a sacco. Ado in tanana sa se te ne, ya te ego che è da nil. Do oba iho yajas kita tani hite nauko. Paas ko si eyan jano tani hite ne saako. Ado ho wajas aagi ita eya. Kuntak nil khato nil tko wada kshin ishna taatish. Do ho hai yuna ni sa jakut ende. Ako ko tiit ego in hiya ta hasli. Ka jakut ene tada khayta ta khadata. Do sa eya chizus ye shil khadneta. Ko ta ay chizus yotna. Do shil nenda ko. Ita le natas an hon geda a ado eya oltka beheya. Ako eed a nasi shata te kui goshin eya nshit olte. Ako an le nshitka e hobro public school ade eya nshitka ako. Ita at aya banya e ashtava kha hol jizuko. Ado an le ho wadan na nstago eya ade eya khata a kiet hon lai tol geo ita hata a kiet. Ta asko da neta atlana halanko. Sani do da atla, chinti da atla. Hint ego eya, nihin ya da hasli. Ado eya nle, watako ultra hat nangi kawaj. Eya aja eya, na ay nishka go. A asla ko. Nde ko ko khashit awa sali nle, khare shin kato nwe ta tzaki ju kwa ya zay ish en zon. Na so se ishe na a. Kwa espe cho a shol jika nge. Ako ti de na so se si si ke. E desda a se beish tkha. Ako itta a job an tsas kheesta a do da tse e ya se otla. Kha shi ta a ni san sin ko. Nik e a job at e nir o a zo nish la. Nli kha re da se tna a lwa ko ko o ko. A job at e nir itta a de akot a se tna a zi so. To o kha yu de e ya chidr se tna a gil. Chidr tso ta. Tla ta chidr tso nishi te zko chidr nishi te gil kla ko. Kot e go e ya ishtla go. Asta eya se ina niti itla ko. Ado ni kehe to ta ko ta ko ta 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 ebe ni na to. Pastan sa pa shna sa ahne. Ado ko oh na gan se e to. E to yo si ti a ko. Ako ado ba am sa ske sa ko ti ta sa na sa a chen de eya. Ako to a hai yu de eya se ina ta ze ndeshti. Ni zi ko. Ha le te ko eya to to si si le ta na halin se ina ko. Ako an le na sa go ta do le ta an le chash khen Bi ghi do chi ya na sa go shan de A do an le ta a e de to da nez ghi e de Bi ghi ba na ish was Ni ke he to da e na na sa te zi ti to a to Si ti ga e ko Yit ni ya na ha lan sa ni chosh is da ten sa ni Ako ka di te go e ya da at la ni sa ni ko Tata hani shin tata a as kon li uwaan yan li Kota nes jet kona nes tis do pij A do mana seller wendo ra Tata as kogo ya si to si te ko Oko di ita o ita na nshi te ita kota A to chizus be ho si he ta Kretan sp na so si Na ki do at ni da ta kon sa da si cha ki ni la Now thanks be unto God Which always causes us to triumph in Christ Make it manifest the Savior of his knowledge by us in every place. I did not know that when Jesus moves, he moves with power. He moves with strength. He moves with love. That is why when you believe in his strength, he mo starts to motivate you. Jesus. <laughs> Bet silis na na la ako. Do hot e o behas sin dan de. Hot e go e behas sa sin de ko. Ado in da. We fail a lot of time because of one simple solution. 
one problem. We must learn to believe. With this, I like to talk about forgiveness. Many of us think that we have sinned, and they are so great that God will not forgive us. God, kwea and hishnele Romans, benasso shtaton as nagon. Khalat atitigin kaat pe naata ni tlingat na peget as sanigi pe atitigin kaat peske nda akiti ni digi aadon ni dibin peget pe inna pe sahekri. Kaya ya e ya Mary Madeline bahana and lena e ben chishkotishin to ask this ago. Because the story is very moving. Oh, I saw na ishna. Mary Madeline was caught in adultery. And Jesus stepped between the accuser and Mary. He was the one that was going to die for Mary's sin. No one ever threw a stone to kill Mary. Jesus told the accuser that if you are without sin, you can throw the first stone. And then he told Mary that neither do I condemn you. Mary, eya kot elba hanne ako. Jo esti lago da neba sustkeja. The Nahata Hotis, eh? A con lele, it has seas. A coat, I don't know, kins and a quiet Jesus to quiet a yako, eh? Hatra e yan. He does a cot el hatas than eco, wasn't that his name there? A con latte percy than Zenigi, I don't get a she describes that that is set at eighty yako. Mary Pickens that told Miss and told Nick Benigi. Nick echo, I don't know that is that Jesus. Mary, Eya, Oba, Tony, and see you to Nico, Eya, and Nedah Nash Elko. Did he keep a name? Mary's case was very hopeless. She seems to have her whole body controlled by demons, her mind was controlled by Satan. But Mary was the one who sat at the feet of Jesus and learned about Jesus. It was Mary who poured upon the head the precious ointment and bathed his feet with her tears. Mary stood beside the cross. Mary followed Jesus to the graveside. Mary was the first one that was at the tomb after his resurrection. It was Mary who first proclaimed the gospel about the risen Jesus. She told her world at the time that our Savior had risen. Jesus knew the circumstances of each soul. You may say, oh, I am so sinful. I am very sinful. You may be, but the worse you are, the more you need Jesus. Jesus will not turn you away. Freely he will pardon you, because he is the sin barrier. You see, each person's experience are different when they are converted. Our experience was very unusual. He began to work with us through miracle. Our Lord has greatly blessed us through Hebrews 11 and 1. Now faith is a substance of things hoped for, evidence of things not seen. God is love. It does not say God has love. He is love. Love is the essence of God's character. Jesus' touch is love. Jesus' tears is love. Apening now, brothers and sisters on this earth, on a reservation. If there was no God, we would all be an accident. Your life would have no purpose. If there is no God, there would be no right and no wrong. There would be no hope for each one of us. You are God's special children. <speaking in Hebrew> God has planted eternity into human heart. Brothers and sisters, 
این اصلا چیز به تنسکیز ایبن این your sin will be forgiven because Jesus became sin for you and he became sin for me. Jesus came from eternity to save you. He left his glory, his divine love, his divine life and came for us. This is why he became a human. You see, Jesus became your trashy life. He became your alcoholic life, your murderous life, your cancerous life. Deep ego, eh, Jesus, na kan na te taako. Mihi kevet o wahato, miga hat ego ta hat es jante. Mihia i taakon ha ni ta aako. Eh, o ta e daakon yana na has te siuko sila. Tis is on den le, el tigas na nero at na si te keko ko. Ti n jail zale bigit e ya. Tumor, so to not the same. A quarter is chuckle, a chance to get a cut up. Quite chimes a slap and then give the tennis cutting sinko. Later, not art nanny, cake out of elders, such that shut up at the top knee. Not so that the dolls need to go. Make a hair go and so that they go. A satia is jet or so that he'll send go. A quarter and lay the จอดสโตร์ตัวตัวเอกชนเลวัชชาติตอนนั้นเลงก็อาชิชะอาดาบิกิสเลเปลติลาสันเนโลนานิตอาชิชอนเนโลชิอะโกดอินสัตอาลา
Jesus, I have decided to follow Jesus. No turning back, no turning back. Hi, J.A. Kids. My name is Martessa. And my name is Kristen. Last week we finished our creation program. But before we move on to something new, let's review. What does the word creation stand for? Eight ways to grow healthier and happier. And what does each letter of creation stand for? Join us, kids. C. Choice. R. Rest. E. Environment. A. Activity. T. Trust in God. I. Interpersonal Relationships O Outlook N Nutrition That spells creation. So now what? We already learned about every health principle. Now we are on to the best part, making creation a part of your life. You kids are God's special creation. He made you. And because God made you, He knows what makes your body work best. These eight health principles are the ingredients for living the best life possible. Ingredients like for a recipe? Yes! God is the cook who created the perfect recipe to make you. It says in Genesis that God shaped Adam from the dust and breathed life into him. God not only made your body and gave you air, he also wrote a list of ingredients that will keep you happy and healthy. Where can I find that recipe? Actually, the ingredients are all over the Bible. Oh, so I get to read the Bible and look for those ingredients like I'm on a treasure hunt. Exactly. Maybe we should share some ingredients from the Bible for the kids. Good idea. Where do we start? Well, our first creation ingredient is choice. Where can we find that ingredient in the Bible? Joshua 24 15. Choose this day whom you will serve. Let's imagine a little girl named Anna. One morning, she wakes up and makes a choice. Kneeling down by her bed, she prays. I choose to follow you today, Jesus. What should I do first? After opening her eyes, Anna sees a Bible by her bed. I will read about Jesus first. That is a good choice, Anna. Then Anna gets up to eat breakfast with her family. School on Zoom is starting soon. Anna grabs her book and joins the meeting. Three hours later, Anna is tired of homework. Her brain hurts. Anna needs another ingredient, rest. The Bible talks about rest in Matthew eleven twenty eight. Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Anna's brain needs a break from all that studying. What should she do? Maybe she could get up and jump on one foot. And when nighttime comes, Anna should go to bed early. Then her brain will work better for school in the morning. Anna decides to get up and jump around outside. On her way to the door, Anna sees trash on the floor. And her toys are scattered everywhere. I think Anna needs the next ingredient, environment. Colossians 1.16 says, For by Jesus all things were created that are in heaven and that are on earth, visible and invisible. Jesus made our world beautiful, but sometimes people make it messy. We can work together to pick up trash, clean our house, and put away toys. Anna decides to clean up before she goes outside for her break. Good job, Anna! After taking a short break and eating lunch, Anna is feeling lazy. She just wants to sit on the couch and watch TV. Uh-oh, that is not a good choice. Sitting down for too long is bad for your body. Let's check out the activity ingredient. 1 Corinthians 6.20 says, God paid a great price for you. Therefore, honor God with your body. You kids are important to God. That is why he wants you to take care of your body by exercising. Anna decides to run around her house three times, even though she feels lazy. And guess what? After running, Anna feels awake and energetic again. Yay! Anna skips into the house again, but almost trips over... Her toys! Anna's little brother had thrown all her toys back on the floor. Anna is mad. Little Isaac is playing with her toys and making a mess. Before Anna reacts, let's show her the next ingredient. Trust in God. Proverbs 3, 5 says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. All Anna wants to do is yell at Isaac and take back her toys, but Jesus is speaking to her heart. He is saying that she should trust in God to help her make a good choice. Instead of being mean, Anna lets Jesus take charge of her life. You can play with my toys, Isaac. Here, let me play with you too. Go, Anna! Anna is adding another ingredient right now. 
interpersonal relationships. Hebrews 13, 16 says, and do not forget to do good and to share with others. Jesus is helping Anna share with Isaac. After playing for a while, Anna gets up and walks around. She is not feeling very cheerful. What can help her? Maybe Anna needs the outlook ingredient. Psalm 136, 1 says, Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. When we say thank you, something good happens in our minds. We become happier and see the world as a better place. Anna says thank you for everything she can think of. Thank you for a warm house, toys, a nice brother, parents, school, my body, clothes, food. Speaking of food, Anna's getting hungry for dinner. What should she eat? Well, our last ingredient in creation is nutrition. John 6, 35. I am the bread of life. He who comes to me shall never hunger, and he who believes in me shall never thirst. Food is important, and we should choose food that keeps us healthy. Anna decides to eat a colorful salad with red tomatoes, orange carrots, yellow bell peppers, and green lettuce. Then she makes a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with whole wheat bread, ending with an apple. Mmm, sounds good. Hey, we just finished learning our eight ingredients of creation. Yes, but hey, are there any bad ingredients? Yes, there are. We should stay away from alcohol, drugs, smoking, friends that hurt us, bad TV programs, and video games. Good point. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for giving us amazing ingredients to help our bodies work better. Please help us stay away from the bad ingredients that hurt us and choose good ones instead. Amen. Be bold, be brave, be different. I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. Tune in next time. No turning back. No turning back. Yeah, Kristen. Thank you, Martessa. And thank you, Isado Shila, for listening in this morning. Last week, Carrie from Tohatchi, New Mexico, called in at the end of our broadcast and said, I really enjoy your program. I listen to you on the way to work every Sunday morning, and it has touched my heart. If you were blessed by today's program, we'd love to hear from you on our dedicated phone line. Please text us or call us at 505 427 3536 and let us know you've been listening today. We have a free copy of the book that first introduced Gregory Holiday to Jesus that we'll be happy to send you if you just give us a call or a text message at 505-427-3536. That book, Steps to Christ, will be sent to you if you just give us a call or a text 505-427-3536. Also, I want to remind you again about our Diné Adventist Radio Bible Correspondence School. If you text or call us at 505-427-3536 and request the Bible lessons, we'll send you the first two colorful, easy lessons of the Native New Day Bible Study course. Look up the answers in your Bible, fill in the blanks, return the answer sheets, text them to us with a picture, or use the return envelope that comes with the lessons. When we receive your answer sheets, we'll send you the next lessons. Study at your own pace. When you complete all 30 lessons, you'll receive a handsome completion certificate and an opportunity to go on with an advanced Bible course as well. And there will never be any charge to you. Our number again is 505-427-3536. Text us right now or leave a voicemail. Be sure to give us the correct spelling of your name and your mailing address. And also send us your prayer requests. Our prayer team is ready to pray with you and for you. Until next week. Bohomnihi Jesus Christ be better job ba Ado the in God be better yo ne in the nut the in e be a hitlini a no so ben hik hodlido a god edo Amen Nijonigo Hinishnado